Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here with a really quick video on my new hair from Lace Hair Collection. This is a new texture, Vietnamese Curly, and I'm already loving it. This is my first time trying it on on camera and styling it and all of that good stuff. So I'm just gonna jump right into the video. So this is my Vietnamese Curly. I'm already loving it. So I definitely think I will be adding this to the website. Um, I just want to test it for like shedding and all of that good stuff. This is a U-part wig. You guys know that U-part wigs are my favorite. I just find them to be most convenient for me. So I have four combs attached at the top. I find that when you do two combs on each side, um, you can anchor it as close as possible and you don't have to leave out as much hair. I also have two combs on the side and this particular cap comes with adjustable straps in the back so I don't need combs there. And I'm going to slide that in the anchor braid and when I really want my wig to look really full at the top I like to sew an extra track right underneath that anchor braid. So that I can literally leave just a slither of my natural hair out. This hair is like super light. I probably should back up because it's bigger than what I thought. So yeah, this is three bundles of 16 inch. I think 16 inch is my favorite length when it comes to curly hair. But it feels extremely light. It doesn't feel heavy at all. But I am going to tame this hair because I don't want to wear it this big. Um, so I'm going to just take um, some water. I forgot to take out my perm rod. So I did this in advance about a few hours ago. I typically do this overnight um, so that I don't have to put any heat on my hair. Um, I find that the perm rods are the easiest for me. So being that I am going to wet the hair down, I'm going to go ahead and wet the hair, but I'm going to avoid wetting my natural hair because I want it to still blend at the roots. So this is the finished look. I ended up pretty much combing out all of my beautiful curls and I wet the hair down. Absolutely loved it. I definitely wanted more of a tame look. I just wet the hair with plain water and I just um, just added a few face framing, framing layers. I was filming it, but the camera cut off anyway. I really didn't have to layer this hair because this is all the same length and I kind of wanted to keep the length in this hair. Uh, once again, this is 16 inch and I'm wearing three bundles. It's definitely different than my Indian Curly. Um, this one has more texture to it. It's a little bit more coarse. I'm also going to be working on um, closures and frontals, so be on the look out for that and um, that's pretty much it loving it so far though this is the perfect vacation hair very very lightweight very low maintenance um, I find that you can kind of do the wet and wavy look with this um, hair texture so um, I think this is the perfect vacay hair you can't go wrong with this um, but that is pretty much it you look I'm loving it look I'm just swinging <laughs> I'm just swinging it and even though I combed all of my curls out, it still blends pretty well with my natural hair. So um, I'm really happy about that. I always get a lot of questions if I make wigs for other people. And the answer is yes. I'm always accepting new clients, new custom orders. And my booking information is always down below. Um, if you see a wig on my website that's sold out, that's just that particular unit. Sometimes I'll make a pre-made pre wig and I'll put it on the website but if you want a custom order just email me and I'll get you squared away if you even like this wig and you want something just like it just link the video let me know what you want the length and everything and I got you um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video thumbs it up if you did leave new video suggestions down below subscribe if you haven't thank you so so much for watching and I will chat with you in the next video